This is a The Left Chapter Soviet History Post. For all of our Soviet History Posts and our other Left History Posts, be sure to visit the website at www.theleftchapter.com. Today we are going to do a tour of Soviet Fronts in 1970. During the Soviet era, the capital of the Kyrgyz SSR was Frunze. It was also known as the City of Green Leaves due to the fact that it had more trees per resident than any other in the USSR at the time. Frunze was named after the Bolshevik revolutionary leader Mikhail Frunze, who was a close associate of Lenin and who died in 1925. Frunze had been born in the city when it was a sleepy czarist outpost called Pishpek. Since the fall of the Soviet Union and the counter-revolution that brought down socialism, the city has been renamed Bishkek. Here we are going to look at nine vintage images of the city in 1970. At that time, the city's population was around 430,000. The first stop on our tour is the Monument to Lenin that was outside of the Polytechnical Institute. Most Soviet cities had a monument to the great revolutionary leader. Next we see the monument to the hero members of the Young Communist League. There were many monuments like this across the Soviet Union in honor of those who gave their lives during the Great Patriotic War against the Nazis and their fascist allies. Here we have an image of the city's Polytechnical School. The MV Frunze Museum. This imposing building was the headquarters of the Central Committee of the Communist Party of Kyrgyzia and the Council of Ministers of the Kyrgyzian Soviet Socialist Republic. the City Soviet of Working People's Deputies. It was here that all municipal political affairs would have been tended to and dealt with, debated, and the appropriate municipal laws passed. The State University Building. The building of the Presidium of the Supreme Soviet of the Kyrgyz Soviet Socialist Republic. The Kyrgyz SSR was one of 15 Soviet Socialist Republics that made up the USSR. And finally, we see the Manas Cinema, which would have been one of several cinema houses throughout the city. I hope you have enjoyed this trip back to the city in 1970. Please be sure to visit the website, theleftchapter.com, for all our related Soviet history and left history posts. Thanks again.